Hi, it's Mark Loftus, senior editor of Post Magazine, and we're back here at NAB Show New York. Uh, we lost our stream for a minute, but we're back, and I want to once again welcome Goldcrest Post Productions' Barbary. He's the director of engineering over there, has an interesting job, interesting background. Barbary, welcome. Thank you, Mark, for this introduction and for having me. Absolutely. Uh, for our viewers who aren't familiar with Goldcrest, I've been over there to your west side facility, so I kind of know your layout, but could you tell us a little bit about the work that you do and the setup that you have? Sure. So Goldcrest is located in the west, west side uh, in New York, and it's a one-stop creative uh, boutique. Uh, we offer a lot of services. We offer like on-set DVDs, picture finishing, uh, sound finishing, and EDR mixing with a 5.1 or 7.1 uh, Atmos capability. So, we, we offer for our clients like a lot of, even before the production, during the production, taking their product and their film, that they spend a lot of time working and crafting to the final stages with a great team of picture finishing and sound finishing and producers as well. And you offer uh, rental services? We offer offline rentals as well. We have, we have yeah, so many rooms. Yeah. It, is that for in-house where they would rent space and use your space or serve systems that can actually go out into the field? I mean, we can, we can do both, mm -hmm. uh, but mainly it's for like in-house, four-wall uh, rentals. And we had we a great solution for offline editing. We can go up to like 4K, 2K. So mm -hmm. it's, we have been trying to keep up with the technology for the last five years and there was a lot of investment Understood. Uh, from, from the company just to keep up with the technology. And every time, like you have workflows like 8K, 4K, they're going more. So right. What yeah. is, you, you guys do independent films? You do television? Can you talk a little bit about who your clients are? Maybe some of the shows or films that sure. people may be familiar sure. with. We do. We do a lot of things. So we do like TV episodic. We do features. We do independent. Plus, we do documentaries as well. But like just to mention like some titles, we did Russian Doll. We did. Uh, uh, Laundromat, we did uh, Divorce, mm -hmm. Millions, uh, we did so many shows. Like, yeah, a combination of shows. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So it's a variety of like TV episodic and, and, and independent uh, films as well. You've got an interesting background in the sense that you were a filmmaker, yeah. and that's kind of how you were introduced to Goldcrest. Yeah. Can you tell us a little bit about your background and what yeah. you're doing now as director of engineering? Sure. Sure. So it's, it's funny enough when you're touching on this, like the first time I walked into Goldcrest, I had a client. Mm -hmm. So uh, I was working on a documentary that uh, for like five years, it was about the Egyptian Revolution that was nominated for an Academy Award in 2015. And it got a lot of awards from Sundance, Toronto Film Festival, Berlin, BAFTA. So it was a long five years for me doing one project. And that's how I got introduced to Nick and Goldcrest. Mm -hmm. And when I moved to, it was a time to move to New York, um, Go Chris was really helpful and Nick was really helpful with me and he said, I have a project. Mm -hmm. And I said, sure, I would love to help. And was uh, the head of production of Go Chris, Gretchen, which is, she had been helping me like for the last five years on so many levels. Mm -hmm. uh, but we had a commission from National Geographic doing a documentary about the war in Syria. Oh wow. And it was, it was a challenge with uh, camera aspects and camera resolution. And Many like, different formats coming yeah, together, yeah. yeah. And even we were like using phones because sometimes you can't go there, you can't be there right. all the time. So that was a, a huge challenge. Uh, but this was, was out in 2017, in July 2017. Wow. Yeah. And now as Director of Engineering, you had mentioned that you've made a commitment to kind of keeping up on the technology. I know you have 4K, I know you have uh, 2K. Where, what is the studio at as far as its level of technology and the sure. investments that it's been making in recent years? Sure. So we have, uh, uh, we just built a picture finishing theater 4K projector. Okay. And we have a 4K HDR room. Uh, we have another theater with 2K projector. We have three mix stages. We have with Atmos and 5.1 and 7.1 capability. We have a lot of offline rooms for, for high end projects. Uh, for offline, and also we have our workflow for the documentaries that we offer as well, with a huge team with, with producers and picture finishing. And it goes beyond film because I know some of these streaming services require, you know, uh, 4K too. And you had mentioned, I think, that you guys do uh, Netflix. Your Netflix. So we are a Netflix 
Netflix certified. Certified, okay. Gold certified since uh, September 2018. Uh, we are Dolby Vision certified. We are MPA and TPN certified as well. Mm -hmm. So we adhere with all the security requirements for these shows uh, because it's now it's like it's more needed than before. Yeah, here in New York at NAB Show New York, they're showing the technology. Obviously, NAB takes place in Las Vegas every April. You've been to a to Las Vegas, you're here in New York. Is there anything you're keeping your eye on technology-wise for the facility or even for the future? Sure, sure. So every time we go to NEP, there is like a huge an announcement about like new technology and stuff. So we keep an eye on everything like during the year, but the opportunity in NEP that you put your hand on like some of these equipment and you know exactly what's, what's, what's happening out. Mm -hmm. And mainly we are focusing on like storage and online storage because we have to keep up with our uh, infrastructure and now like with filmmakers like they want to shoot in 8k 4k and like this 4k is like kind of obsolete <laughs> yeah and like now it's like 8k and people are going more and they yeah. need like more requirements with, with hdr with projection with 3d projection so that's and also this is something i forgot to mention that we do also like um, a lot of remote grading sessions so we have a collaboration with a lot of facilities like in LA and New York, uh, sorry, and, and London that we do remote grading and we do remote sessions. Mm -hmm. Interesting stuff you got going on. If, if somebody wanted to know a little bit more about Goldcrest, is there a website or a yeah, cat so you can direct? Yeah, our website is Goldcrest Post NY and our Instagram at Goldcrest Post. Uh, and also we have we are on Twitter as well, same Goldcrest Post NY. Cool. Well, I want to thank you, Barbary, for joining us, telling us a little bit about what you guys got going on, and definitely check them out online if you'd like to know more. We're thank going to be back in a little bit. Thanks again, Barbary. Thank you so much for having me again. Really appreciate it, Mark. Thank Absolutely. Yeah. We'll be back in just a minute. Thanks.